To understand what is a polynomial, we need to know what is a monomial. Let's say there is a constant and variables. Now if the variables are raised to non-negative integer, and then we multiply them together, we obtain a monomial. For example, 3x squared y is a monomial. In this case, the constant is 3, the variables are x and y, and the exponents are 2 and 1, which are non-negative integers. If, for example, the constant is 1, we omit writing it. So an expression like x squared y is also a monomial whose constant is 1. Negative 1 half z raised to 5 is also a monomial. In this case, the constant is negative 1 half, the variable is z, and the exponent is 5, which is a non-negative integer. A constant is a special case of a monomial. For example, 6x raised to 0, y raised to 0, is a monomial. In this case, the constant is 6, the variables are x and y, and the exponents are 0, which is also a non-negative integer. But since any number of variable raised to 0 is 1, then the expression reduces to a constant. So therefore, a constant is also a monomial. Now what is not a monomial? 4xyz raised to negative 3 is not a monomial because of the negative exponent. 2xy raised to 1 half is also not a monomial because the exponent is not an integer. So now that we know what is a monomial, we can now define what is a polynomial. A polynomial is a sum of monomials. For example, 6y cubed z plus xy squared is a polynomial because it is a sum of two monomials. A special name for a polynomial with two monomials is binomial. 4x squared y squared plus 2xy squared minus x is a polynomial because it is a sum of three monomials. A special name for a polynomial with three monomials is trinomial. x cubed minus 3x squared plus 3x plus 1 is a polynomial because it is a sum of four monomials. Polynomials with four or more monomials are simply called polynomials. And that is a polynomial in a nutshell. Thanks for watching.